Life Audio. Thank you for listening to your daily prayer, a podcast dedicated to helping you find the words you need to connect with your Father in heaven. No matter what is going on in your life today, you can trust that God wants to hear from you. Right after this short word from our sponsor, we will pray through today's prayer together. A Prayer for Your Goals in the New Year Written by Molly Law Read by Leah Arthur Your eyes saw my unformed body. All the days ordained for me were written in your book before one of them came to be. Psalm 139, 16. The year 2022 is over and done with, and the new year, as it always does, has begun in earnest. Every year, as New Year's Day draws closer, we all want to imagine that a prosperous and optimistic future awaits us. So much so that we alienate ourselves from all the bad that we experienced during the past year and look forward to a new beginning. But let us not forget the good we also experienced in this past year and continue to seek the Lord's guiding presence in the new year. For we know that God has been with us in 2022, just as he has been from the beginning and will be there until the end. Emmanuel, God with us, is a promise that endures. When we accepted Jesus as our Lord and Savior, we received his constant joy and hope in his enduring promise. We can feel his presence through the gospel and the indwelling of the Holy Spirit. There are so many in this world who will enter 2023 without hope and without peace that can only come through Christ. When that hope is not found in Christ, people seek to find a way to fill the void in their hearts with what they envision this new year will do for them. The most popular New Year's resolution is to lose weight. People tell themselves that if they lose X number of pounds, then their lives will be better. They will get that promotion, they will go on dates, and they will become the person they were always meant to be. This is a lie from the world from the enemy. But the truth the Lord wants us all to know is that you, right now, are the person that God created you to be. Just as you are, not 10 pounds smaller, not, quote, healthier, not anything that influencer told you on Instagram. Many diet books and influencers, some even Christian influencers, send mixed messages. You're beautiful the way you are right now. Healthy is beautiful. So do this and lose weight. Subtext, to change who you are despite what I originally said. Please know that you are beautiful, wonderfully made, and exactly who God created you to be. No additions, no caveats, no subtext to that message. Full stop. The new year is a passage of time that does not have to signify a radical change and it will not fulfill the hope that many place in its inanimate hands. So, before we focus on our appearances, goals, and vision boards for the new year, let us remember our true calling to be fishers of men, Mark 1.17, and make disciples of all nations, Matthew 28.19, by loving others as we love ourselves, Matthew 22.29. Let's pray. Dear Lord, I pray for everyone this new year. I pray that the hope for a better future will not be placed in an inanimate object that has no conscious thought or care for the ones putting all their hope and faith into it. My God, I pray that they will find you to place their joy, fear, hope, and faith in you and in you alone. I pray for the lost, the hurt, and the jaded. I pray for the pain and rejection that the world inflicted on them. Lord, may we gain compassion and understanding from you so that we may shine your love and light 
in a darkened world as we leave the old behind and embrace the new with you, our Alpha and Omega, our Prince of Peace, Lord of Lords, and King of Kings. Help us to not only remember the hardships of the past year, but also the wonderful memories. I pray that we not only embrace the good in the new year, but lean on you when hard times eventually come. Thank you, Prince of Peace, for drawing close to us with your comforting presence, guiding us in this fallen and messy world. We love and trust you with all of our hearts, our Savior and King. In Jesus' name, amen. Your Daily Prayer is a production of Life Audio and Salem Media. If you liked what you heard today, please take a second to rate and review this podcast in your favorite podcast app so that more listeners like you can find the show. For more faith-filled, inspirational podcasts, visit us at lifeaudio.com.